listeners, I am Dr. Pawan Kumar. We continue the series about uh, heart wall uh, surgery and today uh, I will discuss more about mechanical heart wall. As I told you last time, mechanical heart walls are made of steel and with a pyrite carbon. The, these are the oldest heart walls which were used to replace original uh, deceased heart wall. Uh, first, when they started off, we had uh, there are different varieties of mechanical heart valves. One is with one cusp, this is of two cusp, there, uh, and some of them are, uh, are very uh, high on, uh, on uh, uh, steel and less of the, the swing ring. So, there are different varieties of them. The, one of the commonest valves are these bileaflet valves and these valves open and close, open and close as the blood flows across them. But as there are artificial surfaces, so that is where blood can get clotted or clot formation can occur on these valve surfaces. So for that to maintain, maintain we have to maintain your blood as a thin uh, continuous flow and clot should not happen. That is why when we use these valves, usually we keep these patients on blood thinners, uh, higher stronger blood thinners like uh, coumarins and warfarins are given to these patients to maintain uh, the functionality of these heart valves. So mechanical heart valves are usually used in uh, uh, younger uh, patients because they are uh, they have durability, their long term results are well known beyond 25 years, 30 years, 40 years, I have been operating these patients in early 90s and uh, for the last 40 years they have been maintaining their blood thinness and the valves are functioning fine. When we started off, there are three generations of the heart mechanical heart valves. First one was a ball and cage valve, second came the monocus valve and third one, third generation is bileaflet valves. So these are the, uh, the uh, valves which are now practically used all over across the world in heart valve surgeries, replacement surgeries and they have given excellent results uh, throughout the decades after the operation and that is what the information I wanted to give you about mechanical heart valve prosthesis and use of uh, heart valve replacement surgery. Thank you very much.